Hi guys, welcome to the world of aviation and science. Today in this video guys, I'm going to be explaining you about four different aerodynamic forces which act on plane when flies. Plus, I'm also going to be explaining you about stall and angle of attack. So let's get started. When an aircraft flies, there are four aerodynamic forces which act on them. They are lift, drag, weight and thrust. Drag is a force of an object's resisting movement from fluid like air. It opposes the motion of the object. The weight of the material used in the aircraft along with the weight of the passenger, pilot, baggage and fuel makes the gross weight. The gross weight along with the gravity forces the aircraft to move down. This force is called weight. The wings on an aircraft are shaped like airfoil. So, when an aircraft moves forward, the wind which helps it to generate lift is called the relative wind. The shape of the wing forces the air to move faster at the top. As we know that high speed winds are always accompanied by low pressure area. The high speed winds on top of the wing creates a low pressure area. Therefore, it creates a high pressure area beneath the wing which pushes the wing. This provides lift to the aircraft. Thrust is used to overcome the drag of an aircraft. The propellers on the aircraft helps the aircraft to move forward. Thus, propellers create thrust. So, when an aircraft flies, the thrust produced should be equal or greater than the drag. And the lift produced should be equal or greater than the weight. The Angle of Attack Starting with the pitch angle, the pitch of the aircraft relative to the horizon forms the pitch angle. As the plane climbs or descends, they have a higher pitch, but they don't climb or descend as good. It appears as if they are dragging through the air. So, the path along which the flight moves forms the flight path. The flight path relative to the horizon forms the flight path angle. The flight path angle subtracted from the pitch angle gives the angle of attack. Stall Stall is a reduction in the lift generated by the aircraft when the angle of attack is increased. This occurs when the angle of attack exceeds 15 degrees. Higher angle of attack separates the wind flowing as shown here. Therefore, turbulent air flows over the wings. This forces the aircraft's nose to pitch down. That's it for today guys. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe it. Till then, goodbye.